Hello, 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 hello. Sorry, uh, f uh, first thing for everyone who's going to end up watching this live, uh, or even afterwards, that today was supposed to be No Man's Sky, but due to Ethan having internet issues and Cody being non-responsive, uh, it was just not going to happen. So, instead, we're going to be doing something that I've been wanting to do for a while. I've always said that I feel like I'm a pretty good Zombies player, but I could be definitely way better. And easiest way I feel like to do that is to start doing high rounds, which is also something I want to do. My highest, I want to admit, legitimate round was probably around 50 to 55. I can't exactly remember, though I have gotten to uh, 70, or 70 or so, but that was not in the most legitimate means. Anyway, we're going to have a few rules. The rules are, I can use gobble guns, but they ha they cannot be megas. They have to be the normal base amount, uh, or the base ones. I can use anything else. I have not looked up any specific high rounding strategies. I want to have one attempt where I go through every single map and try to just get the highest round possible first, and that will be this stream and probably the next one that I do of this series. Likely. I doubt I'd get through all the maps today. Hopefully I don't get through a lot. <laughs> the plan. But we're gonna also go be, be uh we're also going to be going through release order. So we're gonna go from knocked all the way to revelations. So uh, we will not be going straight down the list from shadows. I feel like that's just the easiest way to do it. My current Highest on Noct, I think, is like 30. So that's not great, but that's not bad. And as said, I can't use like Pack-a-Punch Gobble Gums or stuff like that. So getting super high rounds on Noct, Verruckt, and Shinonuma are probably going to be a little harder for me, but we're just going to have to find out. Overall, I, sh I expect I should be able to get to that 30 area. I will be very unhappy if I get less. Also, in this current version, I'm only going to be getting one attempt per each map. We're going to set a bar. I get one attempt, whatever round I get. That's the high round I have to beat next time. So you know there's going to be at least one where I die at like round three, and it's going to be really depressing to look at. I'm going to get like a spreadsheet and everything. It's going to be great. And we're going to see my improvement over time. Come on. Oh, Jesus. Why does it do that on this map? I understand the other ones. Alright. The classic. The first map. I played this map when it originally released. This is the very first zombie map that I played. Well, not not this version. The World of War version. And... Uh, yeah, I beat it like, right after beating the campaign. I rolled right into this like a lot of people did. And I feel like that's, that's the best version of the Zombies experience. Being there from the beginning, experiencing it that way. Like a, like a lot of my friends I don't think did. I, I think they missed out. Also thinking on this map, points aren't super helpful. And do I want to stay in the starting room for a long time? Because the, the benefit to Noct, at least in the original, was not many zombies spawned at one time. I'm sure Black Ops 3 version isn't the same. But regardless, they have super far away spawns. At least downstairs. Up to, once you get upstairs, I think they're a lot faster. So I'm sure high rounding is to... to you want it, I guess you want it to be as fast as possible. Because you want to just skip through rounds. There's no real point in keeping zombies around. Because, I, I, like I said, I haven't looked up anything for high rounding. But uh, if I had to guess, you'd probably want to find where zombies spawn the most. And huddle there. Or the fastest, not the most. When did I shoot you? I guess it just felt like it. Right, and actually yesterday, uh, we did, me and Kevin did a zombies challenge, the one, two, three challenge. That was really fun, and I wanted to go in and do more. And a lot of people were interested in it. They were in on it. So, uh, 
hopefully you like this as well. Though I will say this is going to be a little bit slower, and unless we get a chat going, maybe a little bit... Uh, it won't be as exciting in between rounds, because I can't bounce off of Kevin. But I'll, I'll try to do my best. Also, uh, I, I do want to point out, it, while it is against the rule, uh, while I'm not going to look up high round stuff yet, at least in my first attempt, I will be taking comments for it. Because, uh, also, scrolling through videos is not nearly as cool. I was just getting it directly from you guys. And then you can also feed me bad information. I guess that's part of the challenge. Ugh. I trust you, though. Watch, Ethan's gonna come in here and be like, what you want to do every round. Uh, I, I, I don't know, it's a terrible decision. I don't know, that was, that was kind of good. Good news on this version, we can get Mule Kick. So three weapons is fine. It's not the best. Definitely want to get Thunder Gun. Probably something... I think it was a bit slow. Especially to reload because we don't have uh, Speed Cola. But I guess the question is, do we want to go up top or through here? Because the camping spot wouldn't be great for this. If, if I if we were playing like three, four people, that would be pretty fun. But just in a general sense of trying to survive, not great. Definitely want to train. Now, let's see, do I want to do it in the starting room or in there? I usually do it out here. I guess either one is fine if I if I go up to the top. So. You just pick and choose. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I can use that. Okay, great. No, we can get speed cola. This is this is amazing. I forgot. I actually forgot this is on the map. Get out of here. Let's just go ahead and go. Give me gun. I need gun. Uh, give me different gun. Vespers, okay, but not fantastic. Uh, better, but still not what I want. Die. Actually, actually this is fine for now. This will build up points, and then points can be getting perks as fast as possible. But it definitely could be worse. Definitely could be worse. Did they respawn? Why? It's around three. There's no need for them to respawn. I also don't know if I want to rebuild barriers. Because once again, I do want them to come in. Like, I mean, certain ones, uh, yes. Like if I was going to be staying here, I'd want to keep that one rebuilt. But in a general sense, I want them to get in here as fast as possible, right? It's you. It's not you. Who else is left? Which one? What? Uh, what? Come on, guys. I know it's only round three, but if you could be any faster, that'd be amazing. Well, speed doesn't technically matter. If we do end up, for some reason, getting into high rounds, I don't want to be here for eight hours. Yes, I'm, I'm, I'm willing to be here for eight hours, but it wouldn't be preferable. Fuck. Come on. Finally. What do we... Why are more things exploding? Okay. 
I think our best bet for now is to stick down here. I know, I know we could train in there, but it's only around four. We got pretty decent weapons, at least for points. I don't have challenges, but I would like to get more headshots. It makes me feel good. Like if I play if I play a giant game and I don't end up with like fifteen hundred headshots, I'm just sad. Come on, everybody. Maybe we should go upstairs. Or will they spawn downstairs anyway? This has to be one of the worst maps to do high rounds on, like in a general sense, because of how slow they come in. Get out of here. <gasps> That's nice. Hey, Primal! How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Get the hell out of here. Alright. We're fine. Everything's fine. We're good. So we'll say, because we're trying to basically hunt down rounds, in a weird turn of events, we're kind of being the hunters. Like, wherever they are, we want to be. Oh. Hello? Oh, I thought I heard him. I thought it was right there. Get out of here. Anyone? There he is. Where? I hear him. You only just got the notification? It happens. YouTube's weird. Yeah, on, on my phone, which I used to monitor, you know, uh, it gave me the notification pretty fast, but it happens. I know, uh, Leslie, uh, you don't know how bad I push for No Man's Sky. Like, if I, I, I should get a screen cap of the, of the chat. I love that game. I adore it. But, as I explained earlier, uh, which you obviously, with notification just went out apparently. Uh, Ethan's having internet issues, plus he has a job interview he had to go to, so Ethan couldn't really join. And then Cody was just non-responsive. And while I could play alone, and I'm, and I'm fine with doing so, I don't, I wouldn't do story stuff anyway without them, but playing without them in a, oh yes. Uh... Playing without them in that series kind of negates the point, you know? At least that's how I feel about it. Now, if... Because I, I, I also didn't want to do it, which I would do it solo, but I didn't want to because Cody was unresponsive, as I mentioned. Like, if he was like, sure, go ahead, do non-story-based stuff without us, I would have done it. But also, this is something, the high rounding series is something I've been wanting to do for a while anyway. And yesterday kind of helped open the door for this. There's a lot of people very active in that chat. It, well, except for one, well, one guy was very active, but I wish that he wasn't. But everyone else was perfectly fine and, and dandy. And it was really fun. And yeah, I just thought, why, why not just start now? Because I had to do something today that wasn't No Man's Sky, too much to my sadness. But I do appreciate you stopping in. As, you know, uh, just to, you know, re-up everybody, we are going through every single map in release order and trying to get the highest round possible with one attempt the first time. I only get one attempt per map the first time around. I have not looked up any high rounding tips. This is just a baseline. That's all this is. is see where I'm at and then we can go from there. So whatever we get to, that's it. Fair enough. It's just a shame. Yeah, uh, I know. I'm like it is I, I'm happy because I, I wanted to do this anyway, as, as I said, but I really love No Man's Sky. Like, uh, it's probably my favorite game right now. And not being played is sad, but it's it was just simply not in the cards with everything that was going on. What? What kind of sound? 
Kind of like the sounds of server event. What? What round do you think you'll get to? The last time I played this... Also, I'm not allowed to use Mega Gobble Gums. I, admit, I forgot to mention that. I'm only allowed to use the base tier Gobble Gums. And with that, last time I played Noct, trying to just get the highest round possible, not specifically high rounding, similar to this, I got to like 33, I think. But I did have like double packed weapons and stuff. And I think I actually had to leave and do something. So I could have got higher. Oh, oh, you're talking about the TF2 server event that didn't go well because everyone left and we and it just turned into me and you playing that puzzle game, which was really fun. Uh, if you haven't seen that, me and Primal played through We Were Here. It was really fun. Yeah, that was supposed to be the server event, but uh, hopefully we become more of a, We had to talk about it a little bit, so hopefully we become more of a cohesive unit when it comes to server events and we can get them to be more about how they're supposed to be and how they were before that that week it's just uh, not to air dirty laundry but it's just we have a few people that don't care for the stream side which is the main point of it all Ooh, i will easily take that every day of the week in fact that's the best one we could have gotten Lovely. I think we should trade out the Vesper. You gotta go. I love you, Vesp, but you got you, you're no longer useful. And developed lore. Um, uh, man, I develop lore for everything. I'm, I'm that's just what I do. I, I write a lot, so that kind of stuff. It just I just do it for fun. <gasps> hey. I mean, if you're just gonna give me some of the best weapons in the game, I, I, I'll, I'll be here for it. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> BO3 and PS3, it's good. This is on PC, not, not, uh, not PS3, but that era, yes. Uh, I, well, no, Xbox, I mean, this was more Xbox One, PS4 era, not, not PS3, but th this map came out in that era. That's, that's true. I don't know what you're questioning, uh, uh, DZ. Cause this is the Black Ops 3 version of this map. Which that would be 2015, that would be Xbox One, PS3. Or PS4, rather. Though War of War was PS3, X, uh, Xbox 360, it, that's when I originally played it. But I usually keep them separate in my brain because they almost do feel like two totally different maps. Like, if you, take, if you take the atmosphere from this version to the atmosphere in the original, two totally different maps, in my opinion. Like, it, it, it's so much better in the original style than this one. It's almost, like, too flashy, in my opinion. Like, flickering lights everywhere and, you know, wear and tear. Or the original one is just scary because of the sounds. Because it tried to scare you. Made you feel isolated. Also, the weapon selection wasn't as good. 90% uh, of, the, of, the, of the things I could get out of that box are going to be fine. Like, like I said, Vesper, perfectly fine. I mean, once again, if you're just going to give me all the good stuff, I'll take it. I don't know where I should be. Should I be upstairs? So they spawn faster? Does it even matter in this map? Because I, I will say this. It's going to get a lot faster as the series goes on because old, newer maps will be more... Uh, more will be more? That's not in good English. Doesn't matter. They're more... They're... they're fuck... They're built to be faster. Spawn rates are faster. Zombies get in faster. Uh, and we can progress rounds faster. Whereas you see in this one, we're still only round eight. And they spawn way out there. And slowly crawl in. 
Although I haven't seen any running one. There we go. That's a running guy. I, I just don't distinctly remember seeing running zombies yet. You know, it's only even though it is round eight. Shouldn't it be like round five when that stuff happens? Do you remember? Have you ever played the original Verrucked? Anybody? Because when I remember when Verrucked came out and they added the there's. In reality, there's walking zombies, there's running zombies, and then there's sprinting zombies. Sprinting zombies, to my knowledge, was only in the original Verrucked. Or they would run faster than you could sprint. And it, it, it was just... It made, the, it made it so much scarier, so much harder. You High rounding on the original... Ooh. I want double tap. But it is... Okay, let's just do it. Getting an extra good hits in, and I can buy grenades off the wall. I feel like ultimately it'd be kind of stupid not to get Widows. I hope that's not a mistake. Because I'm fine with rolling two weapons. We don't need three weapons. But now it's like speed or double tap. Which, we do have the RPK. So I think speed's going to be better, but that means our guns are going to start hitting a wall faster without double tap I don't know maybe I should have just gone original four but extra hits never hurt anybody uh, mm, we'll see we'll see if we keep getting uh, a quick revive we have at least three lives so maybe we'll get the the original four at some point give me that I don't even think I had. I, I don't think I had a grenade missing. What was the point of that pop up? Get out of here. You know what I need? I need Alchem. That's what I need. That that's long term success right there. Which isn't that, but that's technically better. So we're taking it. You, give me something good. You've done it so far. No. <laughs> <laughs> something good, something good, something good. Deadshot. Uh, that's slightly useful, but not really. I can always just aim slightly higher. I guess the other good news is that we do have high damaging weapons this early. I'm not too worried about getting attacked suddenly by a group. Don't really need it, but I'm sure there's some reason why I should get it, right? Just in case. Like, if I go down, I can replace my stuff better, faster, stronger. Other Daft Puck songs. Get the hell out of here. Terminator noises. I can't do voices. I wish I could. Maybe one day. I'll, tr I'll, tr I'll train up. I don't think that's how that works. I think it's like one of those things that you can or cannot do. Did they even spawn down here? Oh no, they are. Oh, they're not, not there though. I wonder why. Is it just because I haven't really been over here? Perfect. Oh, well. I guess the instant won't really matter. But at least we have it. You. Give me good stuff. Now we're in a pickle. Fuck it. Here and now, you know? The best perk you have is the... Well, the best perk for you is the one that you have. Uh, Primal, you, when you put a question mark, you're just... You're gonna have to put me some context here. I don't... I say too much stuff for you to question. Unless you're questioning everything. Which is fine, I under perfectly understandable, but I don't know what you mean. Get out of here. Oh, also, luckily, the RPK reloads pretty fast for a light machine gun. Once again, I'm not 
I'm not super worried about not being able to speed reload. Gotta keep eyes on that window. I should roll for Alchem. Oh, uh, my head, the hesitation. What stock option? Uh, that's not bad. Light machine gun. What the hell? Who? Where were you? Where did you come from? Get out of here. My hesitation came from, did I want to reload faster or did I want to do double damage? Potential double damage. And obviously, I have two very powerful guns. So, needing double damage isn't super useful right now. But once again, luckily the RPK-4 being a light machine gun does reload pretty fast. So it's not that big of an issue. What we need is that. Alchem is the backbone of this challenge. Like, the only way you're feasibly going to be able to get super high round is with Alchem. And that's with any map. Because if we get Thunder Gun later, which I do plan on getting, because it, I mean, it's, I think the only infinite da damage gun on this map. Get out of here. That's the only real way forward that I see for us to get ammo for it, because we can't rely on max ammos. But I do know that with Alchem, if we consistently get it, I'll have essentially infinite ammo with a Thunder Gun. And once you get that, you're, you, it's, it's just a matter of us messing up, right? Which maybe is... Uh, RPK has a lot of ammo and it reloads fast and it's high damage. So maybe we should keep RPK, get rid of the Haymaker for the Thunder Gun. Because we're not going to rock Mule Kick anyway then we're going to eventually need the Thunder Gun regardless. Like, the, 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 we... Success does not come long-term without the Thunder Gun. That's just, it's just not going to happen. If, you get, if you're getting to round 50, per se, not that I think we might get that high. That's, that's, that's potential in the cards. But to get beyond that, well, even with Double Tap, the RPK... Maybe the Haymaker, but it's going to run out of bullets or shells more accurately. By the time it matters, like by the time you start really getting to be able to kill stuff. That I do believe uh, uh, Thunder Gun is a necessity. And on top of that, Alchem is even more of a necessity. Yeah, I may not know. I may not have really practiced high rounding so far in my zombies career, my illustrious zombies career. We can just render our alchem that we already popped useless for a minute. But I do know some things. That's what I was getting at. <gasps> you lived? That's impressive. You're dead now. They seem to spawn fairly fast while we're right here. I think things are kicking up now that the zombies are consistently running. Here, we can roll to see if we can up our... Nope. I'd rather have one alchem than stock option, which is what that it was. But anytime we can refresh alchem, that's going to be better. I probably should have saved it to the end of the round, now that I think about it. And things for later. Come on. Oh, our headshots are all right. I try to keep it like 50-50, if not more. I Preferably, I get like a 70% headshot rate. That's what I try to keep. But I can't go to sleep happy unless I get like a 50%. Hey, did I... You got to pay for that. I didn't say you can come through my windows.
Got him. Okay, great. Fantastic. We didn't even have to think. That's actually pretty useful. Because then we don't have to use ammo, which we do not have to pop alchem. And it's obviously just a, a pretty much instant kill forever. So I'm trying to think of what are the best drops. Nukes are pretty good. Though it does reset them, so they have to come back in, but it does get rid of a lot of zombies. Like that maybe mixed bag on nukes. Uh, max ammos would probably obviously just be the best, no matter what. Instant kill, probably really, uh, probably really good. Double points would have. What maps do I have for Ark? I've never played Ark, so whatever maps you start with. I've never even I've never even started the game. I have it, which I don't think means anything because I think it's a free game anyway. I'm not sure. But I do have it. You get out of here. Yeah, so whatever whatever maps come with the game, that's that's what I got. Never even played it. Never started it. Ooh. I wanted to kill you with a knife, but they were a little too close together for my liking. Get out of here! Did I stop rebuilding? Come on, man. Get with it. I'll be taking that. Ah, I didn't want that to happen. Ah, uh, we still have two grenades. That's fine. You hope uh, you can get a server? I think... Wasn't Cody working on getting... Or doesn't he already have an ARC server? Or he was planning on getting one? Something like that? Because I assume it's so... Oh, I kind of forgot. Yeah, I uh, shouldn't be doing that. Would you be an... Would one of yous be an absolute daisy and drop a spider? That'd be great. Actually, I don't think they drop spiders unless they hit you. Espresso. Hit the hell. Oh, that was not worth it. Give me a second. Everything's fine. Everyone calm the hell down. I didn't watch The Office, but I know that meme. Get out of here. Alright, that was close. At the end of this loop, it will get... What? Of this loop? It'll be a 24-7 server, is that what we're talking about? Oh, that's the only thing I can assume that you mean. And currently it's just, when it's up, it's up. That kind of thing. Oh, oh you just put something in the chat that has brackets and shit? I... You, you think I can understand that? I glance at chat for like two seconds. I'll be taking that. Island V center. Oh, dad. Okay. You put a command in chat. We are at the center. Okay. You're at the center of a loop, I guess. At context clues. I don't know if you heard that scream in the background, but I don't, I don't know what's going on there. Probably nothing. I'm sure it's perfectly fine. Oh no, the ma the map center. I don't know how that works. <gasps> I can't buy grenades. What the? F Why do you have to be right outside my door, people? Anyway, yeah, I don't I don't know anything about the map or its center or why that matters, but I'm sure. It Stop it. What are you? <gasps> Delicious. There's 10 maps and you're at number two. Oh, okay. I, I don't know how arc works, so I don't know if it's... I don't, I don't know if that's uh, really good or if that's at the beginning, because it sounds like it'd be at the beginning. Because two, two out of 10 maps, or does it count down? And you've gone through eight maps already? Hello, Julian. We, uh, as you see, we're going through every single map in release order. 
So technically, that knock would go first, even though this is Black Ops 3 version, obviously. But we are trying to get set a baseline. I have not looked up any high rounding strats or anything. This is just to see where I am. We're gonna. I have one attempt for each map. I can't use Mega Gobble Gums at all uh, at any point. And we're just gonna see how high I can get. And that list, it goes up. Okay, so you have nine, well, you, you have to finish the second map. So you have nine maps to finish entirely. Yes, I can also use anything at my disposal, uh, disposal for any other map. So bows and arrows for Derizon Drac, you know, uh, shields, spikes, everything else is perfectly available. As just as we're playing a normal game, trying to get as high as possible. My current highest for Noct I think is 33, but I did have double packed weapons. I was using Mega Gobble Gums, but I'm gonna try to get back to 30. Like if I don't, I feel like if we don't get to 30, I'll be sad. But uh, as previously, ooh, as previously mentioned, I have not looked up any strategies. This is just me coming in. I thought there was a guy there, but I guess he got through. Though it is kind of refreshing, being the hunter. Oh, Primal, please. <laughs> Anytime I, I, I just see the chat go up, and I just see a bunch of war- <gasps> Max ammo, I need that. Uh, Primal, you're, you're temporarily forgiven. This matters more. Uh, people are behind me. It's fine. How do you not die? Look at that. I plan on to do one sooner since it'll be before I do the 24-7. The plan on one free map until things on other maps do events for it. Okay. So I guess you can kind of explain to me how Ark works. Uh, I know I just know dinosaur game. Game has dinosaurs. That's that that's it. That is that is that all you do? You tame dinosaurs and then you move on to the next map? Is that like the challenge? You tame every type of dinosaur? Can you t tame every type of dinosaur? Liquid Divinium. Ooh. It's not very good, but the Annihilator's in the box. Hello, Jay. As I... To not... <laughs> I don't, don't want to keep repeating, but I guess I gotta fill in time anyway. This is the baseline uh, round. I get one attempt every map. Fuck that gun. Uh, and we're just seeing where I lie. I get one attempt every map. Release order is the way we're going. Oh, oh, it might be now. It won't be. You know what? I take it all back. Widow's Wine was a great choice. See, you, dis you distracted me. See, that, that that's why you're really here, aren't you? You're here to distract me so I lose early. Fucking hell. Kinda need those. What is going on? I need to get out of here. This is not my normal spot. <laughs> Julian, you just died in the Ryzen track? Hey, it happens. We did the Easter egg for it. Even though I was uh, I was just to survive. I know how to do the Void Bow. I know how to do some of the other bows, but I know how to do the Void Bow all the way through, and I know how to live. That's all I was for. <laughs> I don't- I did, didn't help with the Easter Egg any more than that. That was all Ethan. We each trained on one map. Fuck it. I just need a reroll. As sad as that is. I had- I only got the Annihilator. Uh, we each trained on one map. And Ethan's was the rice and drag. I mean... It's not the haymaker. But I'll take it. I'll take this every day. You know what's not a super useful item that I wish was on this map? Trip mines. I love trip mines. Every time I play a map with trip mines, I have to get them. 
they're just they're nice to have they help out a little bit they're not bro you had no head get out of here I know, yeah, like I was saying, the trip mines aren't super useful, but I, but I, I do love them. I They are must-have. On my perfect map, they would always be there. Brother, you need to get the hell out of my face. You know, I don't know how useful the Annihilator is going to end up being, but I guess... Oh, no. At least we have it. Now, question is, we probably... Oh, I don't have frag grenades. I don't have grenades, so I can't make a crawler. That's depressing. Okay, let's weed most of you out. All right. We're going to need to hit the box. A lot. We got 48,000. That's fine. We're going to try to get... The thunder gun. Well, what we do is we do st story maps. Okay, so there's actually story maps, but they're paid. I mean, I guess that makes sense. If the game, if the base game is free, I don't. I think that's fine. Depending on how many people want to play, you're always open for other people to join. Okay. Uh, I don't think. I think it's on the list of series that we could possibly do. Cody had already put it on there. So, maybe one day. I'd probably try it out first, before I would dedicate money to it. It also depends on how much it is, because if it's not that much, then I wouldn't really care. I would, I would take the flyer on it. But, you know, why, why spend money if, if you don't need to? Why aren't you working? Work. I said work. Or do you need the, do you need the ray gun to do that? I want music. This game's gonna get copyrighted copyrighted anyway. I don't really care. I don't make money on these I don't make money on these yet. Arc is not free to start with? Then how do I have it? I guess someone gave it to me? Maybe maybe I did get a when I first got my PC, a lot of my friends gave gifted me games. So maybe that was a part of it. Wait. <gasps> yes! Monkeys, 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 monkeys. These aren't going to be soup. Okay, I did get them. There was no noise. Yeah, I was probably gifted. Like I said, when I first got my PC, a lot of my friends just gave me either extra codes. Because I have two friends that have that get Humble Bundles. And they just sent me tons of codes. Well, isn't this ironic? Hello, friend. How have you been? It's been like five minutes. You can make this so much. Hello, friend. <laughs> How's it been? It's been like literally 30 seconds. <laughs> and as much as I don't want to just run around, Dingo's not bad. That's the f it's the fast reloading of the two of the uh, light machine guns. So that's not horrible. I don't want the MP40. But if we're gonna keep rolling anyway, it doesn't really matter. With what I plan to do, you have to... You should get to experience with most, if not every, creature and boss. I mean, that's usually how you want to play games, right? I'm sorry, I'm just gonna... I'm just fishing for a thunder gun. Because, like I said before, you're sure we might be able to get to round 30, but I don't want to. I don't just want to get to round 30, 35. I want to get to as high as possible. I want to get to 50. I want to get higher than 50. But I'm not going to be able to do that without uh, an infinite damage gun, and the only one on this map is the thunder gun. So we're, we're kind of just here. I don't want to get rid of the RPK because it reloads fast, has high damage, and has high ammo capacity. So the Dingo would probably be the only other weapon. 
Even that's slower. So yeah, I'd probably keep the RPK anyway. Oh, that's also arc with mods. Some bosses just don't work. Oh, that's sad. Is it, I assume it's because of the mods. The mods just break it. Man, someone like, like, like quickly look up. What are the what's the odds? What's what are the dr uh, box odds for a thunder gun? Is this we got haymaker and uh, and the man of war like four times now? Oh, speak of the devil. Hello. How you been? It's been an extra five minutes. Please, game. End my in all of this. If I just get the thunder gun once, we'll be fine. Uh, we wouldn't need to change weapons ever. I could just use Alchem, and we would go on with our lives. That's the bootlegger. That's not good. All right, maybe, maybe we gotta try something else. Yeah, try something else. Box isn't liking us right now. Ten percent. I feel like I should have hit it by now. Oh, great! I'm gonna, we're gonna win with the Elkar Nine. That's a challenge. L car nine only. <gasps> I saw it. You fucking tease. I saw it. Did you see it? For like one frame, it was there. Well, the box doesn't move on this map. Yes, Dawson. Uh, as I mentioned earlier, uh, which you weren't here, so you wouldn't have known that. So Ethan, who I we normally play No Man's Sky with Ethan and and Cody. So yesterday that was with Kevin, or Max, which doesn't really matter. Uh, we had fully planned on it, but Ethan had a job interview and his internet's acting up, and then Cody just went completely dark. I don't even know what happened. He just didn't respond to anything. And I didn't want to start later than four, so I was like, fuck it, this series is something I've been wanting to do for a while. Gave me an excuse to do it. I was feeling zombies after yesterday. That went very well. In my opinion, even even when I started playing really bad, it was still fun. So yes, we are playing the zombies instead. This is yeah, not to be a broken record, but just to keep everyone informed. This is the baseline. I've looked up no tips, no tricks. We're going in every single uh, map in release order, original release order. So Noctis first and Revelations will be last. And we get one attempt per map. That, that That's round one. One Every map gets one attempt, and we just see how far I can get naturally. And right now, I am fishing for a Thunder Gun. Which, sadly, is, gonna, is taking a lot more time than I'd hoped. But at the end of the day, we're going to have to spend the, this time anyway. Whether we do it in round 20 or 25 or even 30, doesn't matter. If we're going to get to a, the highest round possible, we have to get the Thunder Gun. It's just not going to happen any other way. So while I have points, while I'm fully maxed out... Oh yeah, I also can't use Mega Gobble Gums. I have to use the Naturals only. That's, that's, that's the other part. And that's for everything. That's for every single round. I can't use Megas. Because getting, because I have tons of shopping freeze and a few perkaholics, but I just feel like that'd make it too easy, you know. Like that's that's not my that might not be my particular skill, just more of the game handing me everything right off the beginning. Uh, it would be more of a challenge if you only had the World, World of War guns. Technically, I could do that. I can get I can definitely get a mod that replaces all of these weapons with the World of War ones. Which I actually prefer. Uh, I, while I do love the look or the the new lighting aspect of this version of the map, the World of War version just feels so much better, to, in my opinion. Uh, it's probably just nostalgia, but the map just doesn't hit the same. Amex Grand, you're the worst gun. Why would I want you? I would rather have the Elkar Nine. What kind of gun doesn't allow you to reload? I guess one that does this. Did you hear it? Did you hear the M1 Grand Ping? 
It was very quiet for some reason, because if you remember in World of War, the M1 Grand Ping was so loud. <laughs> Which it is in real life, so I guess it's just realistic. You always make this easy, in my opinion. Yeah, that's why I, I'm only limiting myself to the natural ones. And sure, even Alchem, the one I'm having right now, makes it easier. Uh, that's just a part of the base game, you know. I, I don't feel like that's bad. I don't think I don't. I don't think I've ever seen a high round attempt on Black Ops Three where people weren't using at least the base level gobble gums. So, to my knowledge, it's common practice. Is there a perk on this map? Map? I assume you meant. Well, naturally, there is Mill Kick because they added that in the Black Ops One version. And they just kept that. And then, as you see at the bottom left of the screen, there is a Wonder Fizz machine up there. And we just spun on that. Because, like I said, we're, we're playing the Black Ops 3 version. So, we're using the Black Ops 3 rules. You've already started testing things for your single player? Your custom bosses? Okay, so he's talking about Ark. Because he plays a lot of Ark. <laughs> on his channel, he, he, he does... Uh, his link is actually on the channel page. If you scroll down to the bottom, it says friends, and he's there. So, uh, yeah, he streams Ark. I've never played the game, and maybe one day I will. It probably will be with Primal if I ever do. Uh, and uh, so if you if you like games like that, you can go over to see his stuff. I assume you do, he does modded Ark. So, if that's any more interesting to you. Man, I'm starting to get to the point where I think we just pushed off till later. This 10% chance is not feeling very good. Usually I have high luck. But this, I gotta admit, this shit's boring for me, which means it has to be even worse for you. And I don't like that. I like to be, I like to attempt to be entertaining. You would just get the one perk like BO1. I think that's perfectly fair. I think that's very reasonable. However, counter offer, um, it, it's on the map. And it's Black Ops 1, so I, I, I didn't think it would be too much of an issue. And is there even a Wonder Fizz on Verruckt? There's not. Uh, no, there is. There is a Wonder Fizz on Verruckt, but we pro I probably won't use it. And let's also be honest, besides Widows, which I would easily replace with uh, Speed Cola, I don't think that would be a huge issue for me. Having the base 4, I think, is fine. Uh, that's usually I run anyway. All right, we're gonna try to get just one of the t better guns. Hopefully still the Thunder Gun. If not, we'll just roll. That's not what I wanted. That's actually the exact opposite of what I wanted. Now, I, I do think that the only using Mule Kick would have been perfectly fair. It's just, if I'm already gonna be using Gobble Gums, if I'm playing this game in Black Ops 3, might as well just use the Black Ops 3 system because to my knowledge, that's how everyone plays this map. So that's the most, quote, honest version of this... of this particular map. Dingo. Not bad. Somewhat fast reload. Not as fast as the RPK. You know, I'm kind of thinking we already have low money anyway. Alright, we got the, we got the Vesper. That's fine. We'll just rock and roll. We'll just deal with it. It's perfectly fine. I didn't want to. I didn't want to sit on round twenty any longer than that. Come on. Let's go. Well, we did, out of that, we did, I guess, upgrade in quotes to the dingo from the haymaker. Uh, even though the Haymaker probably would have been more than fine. I will take that. Really? You got a hit on me? How did that knife not land? I want to, I want I want someone to do like a pixel cut of that, of that knife right there. Where, where did I miss? I want someone to do the to do the math. I want to see, 
<laughs> just someone post a screenshot of a whole like algebraic equation. It has nothing to do with the actual knife statistics. It's just it's like it's not even real, but it's just for the look. You get the hell out of here. Did he hit me? Is that a third hit right there? I made it to round 50 in the original World of War. I never did that. I didn't actually play a lot of Noct after the other maps came out. That's probably why. I mostly played uh, Darius. Darius was my go-to. That's not good. Come on, please. Please box. Uh, sniper gang. Sniper gang for life. I can't even be mad. Patience. Patience is not my virtue. It is a virtue, but it is not mine. Alright, come along. Hey, everybody. That includes you. Ah, nice. This is also the on only other gun that I know of that you can't reload. Uh, Darius, are you talking about Darius being the best map in World at War? I th personally, Darius is my favorite map of all time, so I would be inclined to agree. However, I would add this. I don't think it has the best atmosphere. The original Verruckt still scares me. Like, I'm a grown-ass man, but I don't feel any less of a grown-ass man for saying the original Verruckt is horrifying, and I love it. Get out of here. Like, OG Verruckt was no joke. I'll take that. I'll take that every day of the week. Come on. Should we take... I think we take this moment. Hey, we're good. I, I always constantly have a problem with finding zombies on that staircase the moment I turn left. Alright. This is where I normally train. This is my normal spot. In there is perfectly fine, as you saw. Uh, but it's just... It's not my comfort place. You still play the original, uh, the OG World at War? I do too, occasionally. I, uh, I, I, I have it with possible nefarious means that you can't prove. Uh, no. Two Thunder Guns? I don't, I don't have two Thunder Guns. I only have one Thunder Gun. I don't know what you're talking about, Primal. What's my favorite, the top three zombie maps? Darius would be number one. I'm only saying number one first because I already told you. Number two? That's a really good question. I really like... Uh, Jay loves YouTube. You already said hi, but hello again. <laughs> How you doing? No, try to get two? I can't get two Thunder Guns. It's not possible. <laughs> you can't do that. Number two? Probably Mob of the Dead. I really like Mob of the Dead. I liked Mob of the Dead so much that me and my friend, uh, Cameron, used to uh, go into public lobbies and beat the Easter egg for people. Uh, that's just what we did. That was a normal day for us. Oh, you gotta go, Primal? Good. Uh, thanks for coming in, Primal. Glad to see you. Online zombies solo? Uh, this is solo, yes. Yep, we're just doing- we're doing a base level of high rounds. We're just seeing how high I can get before looking up any strategies or anything. And we do have a preset few rules. I can't use Mega Gobble Gums. I can use anything else on the map. Uh, no cheats, obviously. And I can only use legitimate high round strategies. He didn't die. That bastard. Uh, so Mob of the Dead would probably be two, and then three, maybe Garad Krovi. I really do like Garad Krovi. 
Uh, sir, you're gonna die eventually because there's no pap. I'm gonna die eventually regardless because I can't be here literally all day. Uh, Re Darice number one, number two, Ascension, BO1, and Buried, BO2. That is a very good list. Like, I, I, I think my list is very good. I think that list is also equally as good. Like, and that's not even me, like, blowing smoke. I, I legitimately, I love Buried. I love Ascension. Ascension is also one of my favorite maps. It'd probably be easier for me to give you a top three worst maps and a top three best maps because it's so top heavy. Like the top maps, you can name you can name so many maps there, in my opinion. However, I would say the Black Ops uh, one version of Ascension only because of the black and white. Because in Black Ops three, they do this weird thing where they just desaturate it, and I I don't hate it. But it's not nearly as cool. Yeah, there's no path. Yeah, my highest round previously, before this on here, I did have pack a punch weapons because gobble gums, which is one of the reasons I wanted to limit gobble gum weapons. Oh, that didn't reach. I'm a little bit espresso depresso. That's okay. I I have alchem in the in the back pocket. Which I should probably pop pretty soon. I just don't know how far we are into this map. Worst three, but only Black Ops. Are we counting World at War? Well, not that. To preference, none of the World at War maps would be on that list. But if you just say Black Ops, that only means one, two, and three. In my or and four. Can't forget four. I had a glitch where this uh, where this guy went somewhere on train on shadows and someone left the game at the same time. I was in a spot where the train was out of the map. He's driving until round thirty one. That's weird. I've never actually occurred too many glitches. Okay, so Treyarch zombies, not including Cold War, worst three maps. D uh, 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 any, let's go for three to one. That's that's how God intended. Ooh, that's not good. I don't have bullets. Hmm. Okay. That's fine. Three? I'm trying to think of maps that I just re uh, really don't play or have any interest in playing. Get the hell out of here. Give me back my stuff. I don't really need any of that, but I'll take it. Ooh, I should have popped Alchem and switched. Uh, three, probably. Huh. Revelations, I'm not a big fan of Revelations. I don't think it's a bad map, per se. I don't have a lot of experience with it, but it's definitely not my favorite. Uh, so probably that. Probably Revelations at three. Two... Uh, Shangri La, not because Shangri La was necessarily a bad idea or even a bad map. I was just never really good at it. Uh, a lot of my friends hated it, so I didn't get to play it a lot for nearly as much as I should have. Hey, I didn't see you there. Get out of here. You know, sometimes you just gotta give them the knife. Gotta remind them what what ends they are in. Uh, whose ends they are in? Ooh, they're too far away. Are we good? Anyone else? You? Oh, they're still spawning. Oh, really? I guess we are on 25. We feel like this round has been going on forever. And then one, and then one would be die rise. Uh, the verticality just did not work like Treyarch thought it would. Uh, I just, I don't think they really thought it through as much as everyone assumed that they would. Uh, transit isn't great, but I wouldn't put it on the top three worst because I personally had a, I had a lot of fun moments on it, and I think it's okay, but I can see why people would put that near the bottom. Here we could go. 
Oh, well, uh, fuck me, I guess. Get out of here. Damn, just go away. For like five seconds. Stop it. Get some help. <gasps> I need that. Get out of here. I didn't mean to do I didn't mean to do it twice. Okay, 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 okay. This is fine. I need to close up that window. You get the hell out of here. All right, going good, going good, going better. I missed. Oh no, it ran out. Slowed him down though. And I'm so scared of that right window. Someone's just gonna pop in and ruin my day. Eh. I probably should have killed him with the RPK, but uh, we move. That's okay. It was good because I can have a spot instead of going outside the map with a sword. What? Oh. Number one for me would be Die Rise. Number two, uh, Bus Station. Oh, we were counting the survival maps? I wasn't counting the survival maps, but fair enough. Uh, and three, Voyage of Despair. See, I didn't play a lot of Black Ops 4. So I didn't want to count him on, the, on that list because I think it'd be, uh, I thought it'd be a little bit too biased. Because despite not playing a lot of Shanger Law, I have played a decent chunk of Shanger Law. Like I, I, I've beaten Shanger Law. So I think it was still f within my right, if I, if I can say, to put that on the list. But like, to emphasize, I didn't even personally own Black Ops 4. I've only played it at my friend's house. Because the series had already lost me a bit by then. An upgraded sword is good for going high rounds. Yeah, I, I, we've, we completed the Easter egg for Shadows on the channel, so I do know how to do all that. I'm pretty, yeah, I'm pretty sure we won't be able to. Compl I won't complete the Easter egg. Not that you can on solo for some reason. I hear you. Get out of here. No one loves you. Didn't I just kill you? Get out of here, man! I'm trying to, I'm trying to, I'm trying to, I'm trying to kill the people at the window. They matter more than you. Every restaurant ever, maybe? I don't know. I've never worked in a place like that. Come on. <gasps> Lovely. I'll take that. Uh, and if I had to do number four, it would be Origins. I, I kind of I, I like Origins. I don't, I don't I don't really mind it. I would rather be out of the map than die. <laughs> I guess that's fair. The only time I did Shadows was the first time with three prestige people. Okay. Are you just like prestige once, or like just? I'm at six prestige. I'm a little bit of a tryhard, I guess you could say. Well, unlike, unlike my friends, I actually play solo. Ooh, that's really good. Thank you. Thank you again. Too bad Die Rise uh, could have been good if there was not so much falling. Yeah, no, I agree. I, I love the concept of Die Rise. It's just the map itself. It, it just leaves. Oh, that's sword flay. I thought it was going to be stock option. And I was like, stock option with the thunder gun? How does that work? Does it work? Speaking of. Shit. You die. You die. Get out of here. I'll take that. 
You have been targeted for termination. What the hell? Where did you come from? Use magic. He's a wizard. What's the American school in, uh, in, in Harry Potter? I know that there is one. I don't know the name of it. I'm a, I'm, a very, I'm a very I'm a very based here Harry Potter person. I've seen the movies. That's about it. I think I, I've read the first book. I didn't read the rest of it. I probably should at some point. I just tried to reload and I was like, why am I not reloading? It's because I'm stupid and I forget that I already have infinite, not infinite ammo, but an infinite clip. Oh wait. I really need ammo. Max ammo power-ups, throw all your monkey bombs. Yeah, I I don't I haven't been using the monkey bombs. I probably should. Ah, oh, 29. Good shit. At least the original maker of zombies went out with a bang with buried. Did he he ended with Barry? What a weird one to end out on. Anywhere but here? That's not great. Come on, please. Please, please, it's purple. It's in plain sight. Okay, I, I can't... The problem is I can't really complain because I like in, in plain sight. Problem is it's not Alchem. Would any of you like to drop a max ammo? It would be very helpful. We could help out the poor. The ammo poor. You're not actually helping. You're just... It's like one of those, uh, like, prote <gasps> Why, thank you! Apparently they, they, they were like, oh, oh, charity? I love it. Uh, reload, buddy. Thank you. You know what? Let's go ahead and do it. So I can kill you. Just just for that. I saw Noah use a smart strategy on the world's smallest uh, zombie map. Hold up. Mob of the Dead Origins made by the new zombie maker. I knew Mob of the Dead was made by the story writer, like the guy who made the, the campaign. I didn't know that Origins was done by him too. I guess that's why Samantha Max is American for some reason, in Origins. Uh, there's no reason for it. There's like, yep, she's American now. Deal with it. Even though she's definitely German. <laughs> I mean, she grew up in Nazi Germany. I don't really know how that makes you American. I feel it's very anti-American in my book. Hey, thanks. Fuck off. Ah, it's not worth it. You want that, though. Get out of here. No! Get out of here. Stop taking my grenades. I need those. They're my extra hits. Take that. We take those, we take those. Spin. Yes! All right, so we have Alchem, then it's gonna be the new round and we get one more spin for free. Not that money really matters at this point. Oh yeah, you can't reload the Thunder Gun. That's fine. That's fine, it's perfectly fine. But at least we have ammo now. Ammo is not gonna be an issue. Potentially. I know you're here. Uh, we don't have... We have yet to hit 500 headshots. I'm not happy about that. To be fair, the Thunder Gun does not really allow for headshots, so I doubt... 
It will be a huge thing. I got stuck on the thing. Get out. Get out of here. Well, at least we got to reload the thunder gun. That's that's okay. Yeah, I see you. You ass. If you're gonna jump through my window, the the, la the best thing you could do is not take one of my grenades. Okay, we got we got two left. Get the fuck out of here. Oh. What do you mean no? Everything's fine. Everything everything's everything's great. We're fine. Oh, that's right. What what what's right? I, I thought of that in the head. I knew. I knew. Everything was going to be fine. Yeah, I do. I do. I was trying to fish for ammo. Which I did get on the Thunder Gun, but I did not get. Go away. Stop it. Oh, shit. I'm not super happy about that use. Uh, wow, it shot twice. I only pressed it once. I'm a, I'm not I'm really not happy about that one. Oh, I didn't even grab that. Things are going downhill, man. What happened to us? I ran out of grenades too. Hey buddy, if you would be so kind to drop a max ammo, that'd be great. I don't want to pop my alchem just yet. But I might have to. I think there's only the two zombies left. Okay, I was right. That's fine. Here, let's try to hit this before. Plain sight? No. I would rather have Alchem 1. Alright. Wait till people start coming in. 3, 2, 1. Pop it again. Get some early ammo for later for later round. Man, these got you are just ruining my day. Fuck off. No, no, that's real bad. That's real, real bad. That's real, real bad. Go away. I need all of those. Yes, grenades. Ooh. Ooh, what's my favorite gun on this game? I really like the Man of War, you know? Like, sure, it's ob like, it's just one of the more powerful ones, so it's a little bit more boring in that aspect. But it is just so nice. It's just so cool. The original maker is what made Zombie scary. Also, he made the music good. Like we talked about yesterday, the music in Zombies, at least the original Zombies, was so good. Everything banged. Couldn't miss. Ah, uh, that, uh, that, that was garbage play by me. I should have backed up. It didn't even matter. Don't hit me, don't hit me. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Gotta go. Build up, build up, build up, build up, build up, build up. Nice. Argus is your favorite weapon. You already, I already read that. Uh, also kept it trading different ones until I got it again, packed it again, and went out of the map. It was so good. Okay. Then the other new zombie maker came around and Cold War zombies and to make it like the good old days. Uh, hopefully. I haven't played, as I mentioned before, I haven't played Cold War, but I'm, I am interested in it. So I might have to do that at some point. Yeah, reloading the Thunder Gun ma matters more than reloading the RPK. 
Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it. Just take whatever we get, hopefully I'll come. Anything but here. Not great, not bad. But we're gonna get a second shot. Yeah, once again, not that... Hey, 69,000. Nice. I hear you. Come on. <gasps> that was a lot of bullets. RPK might not be doing it no more. Only like the Ray Gun Mark II is on this map. But I assume it's only the Ray Gun Mark I, and I don't have Danger Closest, so it's too much of a liability to grab. Damn, no spiders. Well, one for one, that's not bad. I keep forgetting that the reach isn't not nearly as far as I think it is. Ah, we didn't get any. That's depressing. There we go. We probably want to trade out. Oh, never mind. Not right now. We probably want to trade out the RPK. It is just not doing it anymore. We're going to wait around to see if you're the last guy. He's not. Oh, he's very much not. Go away. I keep pressing. Why does it keep pressing it twice? That's really bad. That's like horrendously bad. Does this round ever- I, oh, we got the 32. Okay, that's not bad. I'm not- I, I want more. Okay, okay, okay. Now we gotta be really careful. Tomorrow for, th for three would be done by Sledgehammer, isn't it? Hey, it's your favorite gun. For a second, I thought it was a thunder gun. I was like, Primal, I was wrong. You can get two thunder guns. I don't know how it's possible. I've never seen it before. I didn't think it was possible. Boy, how I was wrong. I would just roll both of those. Should have done it earlier, and I didn't. Dingo's not bad. I would like ding. I would like a faster weapon. Because thunder gun's good, obviously, but I feel like we need. Honestly, Haymaker. <gasps> Breaker Mark 2 is on this map! Well, um. I was wrong and stupid and stupid and wrong. Yeah, I like the original age more too. Oh, green? I don't want green. Get out of here. Alright. Rega Mark II is not an infinite damage gun. But it is fairly close. Another green? We don't, we don't, we don't want greens here. We, want, we, want, we don't want greens. Come on. That's an even worse green. I've baffled myself a while to even take that. Uh, in plain sight. Not bad. Not really worth losing one of my one of my uh, grenades for, but we're here. Losing another one. Okay, back up to max. That's fine. Ooh, one more thunder gun. Ray gun. You got to really pull your weight. 
and prove to us why I even got you in the first place. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. That doesn't anger me greatly. Raygun, if you could pull your weight a little bit more, buddy. Damn it. Not happy about that. Not happy about that. Not at all. You know, honestly, let's let's do one of these. Let's do one of these. Age 3 is okay. I Like I said, I never played Cold War. Or any of the zombies after that. So, I, I, I'll just have to take your word for it until I do. I do plan on eventually playing it. Like I, meant, like I mentioned before. Because I know that, hey. I got a daily challenge. I wasn't even trying to do it. Turns out the bow crew of... Don't, what? They hit me from behind. They hit me... Hey. What? Uh-huh? Huh? Did I not throw that? Did... Huh? I'm not... Am I crazy? Did I not throw that monkey? I thought I didn't even think about popping the gobble gum because I just assumed I hit the I hit the monkey. What happened to it? Uh, I'm baffled. I'm sorry. I just I don't even know what just happened here. If anybody else understands, I would love to know. Ow. Get out of my way. Ooh, that's not good. We're fine. Oh, I thought he wasn't going to go for it. I thought, I thought he was not going to go for it. That was going to be really, really sad. Okay, 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 okay. I'll be honest, boys, uh, and, and, and ladies, uh, Rego Mark II is not seeming like the best option right now. Oh, shit, I don't have perks. Uh, uh not that. I have 21 bullets. Yes. Come on. I'll take it. Ooh. It's fine. We got health, and we have uh, uh, another chance. Feel pretty good about it. Uh, ooh, that's not good. How do they keep hitting me from such large distances? This isn't fair. You're cheating. How are you cheating? Stop cheating. You dirty, you dirty cheaters. Uh, this is very not good. Uh, oh, great. My special... Oh, great. Fantastic. Please, give me... Give me anything. Give me anything. Give me literally, uh, garbage. I will take it. Haymaker, that's perfectly fine. Uh... This, this, however, is not fine. <gasps> Please, Haymaker. I need you. My, this is my hour of need. I need a hero, and you're it. What's your... What's your uh, number one perk song? Ooh, that's a... Widow's Wine is pretty good. Uh... I gotta think of them. Just let me buy here. That'd be great. Thank you. Get a what? I also take five shotgun shells to the face before I die. I'll, I gotta turn this franchise around. Things are not going so well. Can you... Did that guy... Did that... I feel like that crawler just took like five Mustang and Sally's to the ass. Speed Cola? I don't remember Speed Cola's off the top of my head. 
Gorgon. Fucking terrible. Okay, good to know. That's right. I still got jukes. I still got jukes. Ah. Oh god. <laughs> Rick on Mark 2 again. Oh no. Oh yeah, I don't have any perks. I forgot. I was like, oh Juggernaut will save me. It will not. Come on guys. Uh we're fine. We're fine. We're good. We're good. We made it out. We just had we had we bridged the storm. People are still spawning? You kidding me? You're all, a lot of you are still spawning. Why? How how long has this round been? Okay, 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 okay. I'll leave one zombie. Yeah, 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 no, that was my plan. It's just the zombies don't stop. They don't stop. Ah, oh, damn it. Oh, it was one off of 500 headshots, too. Do you have any gate worms? Yeah, I, I have half of them. Because we've been going through doing all the... Uh, doing all of the... Um, fuck, I can't even think. I'm so mad at myself. Oh, I could have done so much better. If I had just made sure of my ammo a little bit more with the thunder gun. Uh, we just didn't get Alchem. I should have kept rolling for it. But yeah, we we did all uh, we did the first three Easter eggs. So we did we have the first three gate worms. Man, that was not good. So yes, the uh, Cold War zombies made what War, War, uh, Modern Warfare three. That's surprising. We got four liquid divinity out of that. Okay, round thirty four. You know what? Before any high round strategies or anything, I think on knocked thirty four is okay. I could have done better. But I don't think 34 is bad. Uh, next would be Verrucked. Do I... Here, let's roll, you know? Let's have let's have a good roll. We're not going to be able to use any of these, but let's just see. Soda Fountain's alright. Dead of a Nuclear Winter can get you a Perkaholic. Respin Cycle, I don't even know what that one does. Okay, that's fine. Alright, next will be... Corrupt. Probably only end up doing two today now. Ooh, I'm gonna do this. Infinity Ward made Vanguard? I th I think I know that. Oh, thank you, Julian. I you'd been in one of the streams before. Uh, I, I'm glad that you kept kept around. Set Sword Flay to st or stock option? What do you mean? Uh, I already have stock option and Sword Flay, so I, I have both. And I don't have a lot. some of the under ones that I would use. I don't know. I probably could improve my, my starting options. We'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. What do you mean? What do you mean, Jay? Oh, we got on this no side. Power, no glory. Did I not mention it? I thought I mentioned my number one perk song. You know what I mean, bro? I don't, I, I don't know. I, I'm a little bit distracted. Okay. Uh, Widow's Wine is really good. Double Taps is pretty funny. Uh, Quick Revise is iconic. Lots of electric cherries. I feel like electric cherry might have a good one. Ah, oh, I shot that one already. I thought, he, I thought the faster one was the one that I left open. Put Sword Flay on... Stock option. Uh, I already, I, I already have both. I don't, I don't understand what you mean by putting it on the other one. I have both. I think, I don't know if having it in, in each square uh, increases your chances or not. What do you mean what? I'm running both. I have sword flay and stock option. I got it last game. I remember. Now, if I had to guess, I do think that Verrucked probably won't be as good. 
And not that I'm not gonna not not for my lack of trying, of course. But Oh great, L car nine. I would rather get the KRM. Drop the chips and get me some ammo! I'm not eating chips, Dempsey! Actually, I haven't really eaten chips in a long time. Oh yeah, devil man. What's in there? Oh yeah, do you remember? So I, I, I want to mention something because me and Ethan were playing this map before. In the original World at War, could you not mount the bar here? Like you could buy the bar off the wall and then you can mount it here and shoot down this area as someone trained. I have a distinct memory of that. Maybe I'm wrong, but I, I just feel like you were able to do it. You know, let's just go ahead and get the KRM. Maybe my memory's wrong. Maybe, uh, maybe I'm the problem. I'm actually really glad we came onto this side because my number one spot on this map would be on the other side and I don't want to open that back door. But I don't think I want to camp for solo. I don't want really to play this map solo. There might be a problem later on. <laughs> so I guess training in here with the Wonder Waff might be the best option long term, maybe. I need to find some lead or I'm gonna get bored here! At least we have... Trip Mines. The best gun in... Well, not the best gun, but the best weapon in the game. Right there. My absolute favorite. Hey, you. Stop it. Dempsey, Richtoff, and Nick Lion Uh, well, yeah, that, those are the original, well, not the original. The original are just Marines. Even on this map, the original just had Marines. But they were, uh, introduced to us in the next map. Our good boy. Nikolai does like vodka. I was after that, he's like sixth life. He, uh, uh, he had already been drinking by then, I'm sure. But, well, he's Russian, so he's definitely already drinking by then. But he had, like, f f five wives or something, five or six wives or something like that, and he killed half of them. Okay, stock option this early, not bad. Not what I would have wanted. I, I looked, you you nearly killed me. I know you didn't mean to, and it's my fault entirely for looking down at your comment. But I started to read it, I was like, oh, your number one perk, and then immediately I got double hit. Like, oh, everything's gone wrong. Honestly, honestly, honestly. HVK. Once again, no pack-a-punch. We're not going to have that for the first three maps, actually. Alright, number one perk of all time, Vulture Aid. Really? I mean, Vulture Aid is really useful, but I always found the extra icons on the map to be a little annoying. Like, I would put it higher on the list, but I don't think I'd put it top three. Two speed cola, three death perception. I don't know that one. Is that like a Black Ops 4 and Beyond one? Oh, just rock ICR HVK. We'll just sit here for a minute. We're in no rush. I heard you. It's in Cold War and BO4. Okay, okay. 
Uh, what does it do? What are you? Double points? Fantastic. Shoot him up. Uh, I don't know about that, Dempsey. In a rare turn of events, we actually probably don't want that nuke. I think points matter a little bit more right now. Fantastic. Sweet. Look at that. We got two good rifles. We got we got quick revive. We're gonna get another gobble gum. We got nearly five thousand points. And of course, more importantly, we have trip mines. Give me that. I just like to have that there to tell me if there's anybody at the window, which there is. That kind of sucked that I just knew already, but it happens. Get out of here! Stop touching my window! Anyone else? That guy. Alright, if you can, if you see a zombie, or zombies are behind you, you can see through walls. Oh, that's actually really cool. Well, once I get Cold War, uh, Kevin will be happy, and maybe uh, we'll, we'll rock some death perception. Level thirty. Are you proud of me yet? Get the hell out of here. Go away. I can tell you this, we're gonna have a lot more, if we get to that same round, we're gonna get a lot more headshots. Oh, I say, we don't even have a 50% headshot rate. I'm terrible. When did this happen to me? When have I gone so downhill? This is truly a low point in my zombies experience. Why not? Luke. Liquid Divinium. Hey, perfect. We might want to move on... Hey, we have frag grenades too. I'm not going to use them. Some mats are annoying because you don't have perk machines for the perk that you want. That is true. I guess that's why they added the... Uh... What are they called? I said it earlier. The Wonder Fizz. I guess that's why they added the Wonder Fizz. I'm not a big fan of the Wonder Fizz, though. Being able to get nearly any perk that you want. Like, yeah, it's cool that I can still get Electric Cherry. But I would rather just have the machine. Yeah, you do have to get it from the Wonder Fizz, which is annoying because you just constantly... At one point, I think... I think at one point we're playing, I'm pretty sure it's on the channel. Me and Ethan were playing a game and he rolled dead shot seven times in a row. Like, I don't know what the odds are on that, but they can't be very high. Need some juice soon. I guess I should preference. I think he already had two perks. So right. I guess that takes them out of the running, but still seven times straight, no matter what. That has to be nearly impossible. Did I already get this? I did. Um, yeah, what, mine, mine as well. Get out of here. There's already gonna be another one, isn't there? No. Oh. Come on, zombies. What is that? I'll take it. Wasn't super useful, but always nice to have. 
I'm talking about. I'm gonna do a jig on your insides, freak bag. Why not? Get rid of zombies fast. No, I, I'm feeling pretty good. Feeling pretty good. I think we're set. Probably should have shot them, but uh, it doesn't really matter. I'm, they're gonna die anyway. Whether it's in one hit or in three, I can just buy more ammo. Which is, I think, one of the good things about this version of the map is having the ICR and the HVK on the wall is very nice. My top three worst perks. Uh, who's who? Number one, Tombstone. Tombstone was all right. Tombstone was okay, especially in Black Ops in the Black Ops Two glitch, town glitch, where you can get every perk. Uh, that was pretty good. Uh, yes, that is a glitch, so that's not that's not something you're supposed to be able to do. I understand that, but it, it was just so fun. We used to go like 2v2s and go into town survival and, and see which team could survive the longest. And it's basically whoever got all the perks us first, usually uh, won. Hey, get out of here. What is that? I want that. Wait, we are keeping score? Yes, we are, Dempsey. Keep up. Literally Need all of juice. this is keeping score. Oh no. That's not good. Oh, you're still alive. I thought there was another guy. You remember who's who? I do remember who's who. And I remember it was a garbage version of Tombstone. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was when you went down, you revived completely, but only with your pistol and you had to go and revive yourself. Which is not easy. Like, because if you're on round, like, 50 or, you know, uh, any high round, you don't get, like, a break. It's not like you get what is essentially, um, a in-plane sight or a, uh, blood, uh, zombie blood. That's what I'm looking for. It's like you get one of those and the zombies ignore you. Like, the zombies come immediately after you. And uh, you only have a you have a longer period of time to revive yourself than normal, but it's not an extreme amount. Deadshot's actually good because when I buy it and, and you aim, you aim at the head. That's only for controller, which I use. But if you're using, if you're on PC, it doesn't really do anything. Tombstone comes back in Cold War? Oh, then I'm happy. Because I actually, I, I genuinely do like uh, the idea of Tombstone. Of course, the idea is that you don't want to die at all. But if you're in a friendly game, you're not taking it too seriously, something like Tombstone I think is perfectly fine. It's also a really good movie. You know, I'm actually kind of sad now. Now that in retrospect, I wish we would have been on the other side. Because I probably would camp here and have all the perks. Because while we're doing pretty good now, there is going to be a ramp up where we're going to need long term. How about now? I didn't really need to do that, but why not? If I remember, I think in here has the fastest spawns. So we might go in there later. Hey. Ooh. The game did not like that. Alright, we'll leave that door closed. And don't worry your pretty little head. I will be flushing that toilet at some point. I forget which, which song is for this map. I'm not really thinking about it too hard right now. Yeah. That is the spot. But we will be getting it. Yeah, go.
Do you remember the glitch for the double tap machine that was in World at War? You know, I take it all back. That was the highest run I ever went to. Because you could literally just leave the game on and you you just win. The, the, the zombies would eventually just die out. And I remember we just left our Xbox on for a long time. Way longer than you probably should leave an Xbox on. Oh, jeez. Oh, there's zombies there. Oh, okay, that was unfortunate. Well, going down or down on round 13, I am not pleased. I know. Really gonna pay now. I can I you're right, Dempsey. They are not only everything you just said and more. They are gonna pay. They're all gonna pay. Uh, do you that reminds me. Do you remember the Friday the thirteenth game? I wonder whatever happened to that game. Like, I'm sure it's still in service, but that game was so popular and actually really fun, and then people just fermented herring stopped playing it. Piss. And I know that happens with most games. Eventually, people just stop playing it. I don't know. I, I feel like that game could have deserved a longer lifespan. I don't know what I was really hoping for there. Ow! Stop it. Awesome. I guess we might be able to turn the entire map into a train station. Ow! No, no! You're right, Dempsey, that, that, that was embarrassing. This map just has so many tight corners. As I said earlier, I knew that this one was going to be not so great, but it should be a lot better than 14. See my question? What's your worst three perks of all time? I would say I would agree with who's who. Uh, I would, yeah, I would agree with who's who. I would put... I, I would agree with Deadshot. Uh, I think Deadshot is probably third. Or maybe second. <laughs> Dempsey's just mad. And then... There's gotta be an, another one that's pretty useless. There's gotta be one that I'm just think, not thinking of. Hmm. Trying to go through them all. There's gotta be one more that's just like, eh. I mean, like, I'm only thinking of the games that I've played. Uh, PhD Flopper is nice, but I hardly ever used it. You're partially right. Uh, I know, I know, and to be fair, this has been a very bad run for me. You just had to jinx it. You just had to jinx it. I was gonna get down there. I was gonna try to get the last quick revive, because you get three, I think. Uh, I'm not happy about that. I'm not happy. 15 is garbage. Man, I shouldn't open that door. Yeah. I know. I'm sorry. No, we, we will try this map again. We will. Uh, I, I guess, but like I said... Yeah, you can get Cougar Vibe three times. Like I said, I, I want to go through every map, just one attempt, just to see where I am. Yeah, I know that I know the machine disappears. I, I play solo, but yeah, I, I want to. I just want to get a baseline. And sadly, as much as I know that I could do better on Verrucked, fifteen is currently the baseline. That does mean it'll be easier to beat it later on. Where I think what thirty four we got to unknocked, that would be a little bit harder to beat. I know that I could, if I just ammo managed a little bit better. Ah. Uh... Next is Shinonuma. I don't... I don't know if we're gonna have time for that. Hey, look... Hey, well, great. Liquid Divinium. Fantastic. Hey, near the death experience, though. That's really good. No, no, 15 is absolute garbage. 
No, I, I I don't feel good about that. That was bad. That was real bad. I'm not I'm not too pleased, but it happens. So next would obviously be Shinonuma. I would expect preferably in the 30s range. Like I said, I'm a decent. I, I would say I'm a pretty good zombie player. I wouldn't say I'm a really. I would say I'm great. So getting to constant 50s is not something I do on every map. But in Shinonuma, I should be able to get to mid 30s. The giant should be my best out of the series, pretty much outright. Uh, I would say the. At least you did better. Yeah, no, that's true. Brock is the worst, uh, worst map. It doesn't have pep, and it has yeah, it does have a lot of other issues. It's very tight corners and a lot of other stuff. Now, I still don't feel good about 15 though. If I would have gone to like 20, 25, I could have at least been like, okay, it's not good. It's not what I want, but at least it's around 20 to 25. But 15, there was no reason for that. Uh, but it also does mean that later on it's going to be just easier to beat that score. It's just the game's the game. I said I told Ethan or I told Kevin rather. I was like, there's going to be at one point where I get like round dead on round three for some stupid reason. Uh, that's going to eventually be my fault. And I'm just it's just going to be like the easiest one to beat ever. <laughs> but the giant I would expect to be around around 50. You know, that would probably be my baseline is 45 to 50, if I had to guess. And then everything else from there is going to be questionable. Because a lot of these games, I, a lot of these maps I haven't played in a long time. Like, Kino, let's be honest, I should be able to get to like 65, 70 on Kino. There's no real reason that I shouldn't be able to. But I don't think that I will first try. Because like I said, it's only one attempt per map uh what do i think is gonna be the hardest let's do that real fast i think origins might be the hardest yeah kino should be an easy 50 uh honestly the giant should be a fairly easy 50 um if i had to guess which one would be the hardest the first time through probably origins because if you don't get a good weapon before uh round eight Shanger Law potentially, but Shanger Law has a few good spots that you can roam around in. And if you get the Wonder Weapon pretty fast, you're fine. Oddly enough, I think once we get into the uh, Black Ops 3 maps, like Shadows, the Dreis and Drek, Shinonuma, Grad Krovi, besides Revelations, I would expect a constant 30 round, uh, uh, roughly. Uh... Hey Lemon, do you think it's easy on to die on die rise? If you don't know the map, absolutely. Fall damage, falling off the map, not making certain jumps, not knowing where to put your trample steam in order to launch yourself. Absolutely. I think it would be very easy to die if you don't know. If you played a lot of the map and you know everything, that would be pretty good. You're one of the rare people that love Shanger Law. I found a new love for Shanger Law when me and Ethan played it in the starting room challenge. I think it was. It was one of the two challenges. Falling off the map, fall damage is not. You said die rise, right? Yeah, die rise. You can fall off the map and you can have fall damage. In fact, I think someone made a. I have I have tons of modded maps, as you see. I have 104 maps. I think someone made a modded a, a quote modded. It, they just re-implement it. I'm sorry, I'm just trying to understand what you mean. Uh, I'm sure someone did a Die Rise for Black Ops 3. I'll probably look for it. Maybe we can play Die Rise. Give that a go. Just for fun. We'll just, we'll have a, a, a stream where it's all of the quote worst maps. And that's just all we'll do. Um, Jumping jacks are crazy on Die Rise. Yeah, I, I never liked Die Rise. I didn't play a lot of it. I mean, I do have Black Ops 2. So I guess I can just load into Black Ops 2. We can just fucking play Die Rise originally. I don't need to play the modded version. <laughs> Um, I love how it's called Die Rise when I've been calling it Die and Drag instead. No, Die Rise and Drag is this. This one's super easy. Now, Die and Drag, out of the Black Ops 3 maps, original, I would say Die Rise is going to be my second easiest. I would say Grod Krovi would be my first. 
I already played Grod Krovi, and the second time I played it, I got to like round 34. And now I know the map a lot more. I know how to upgrade the shield. I know how to do all those things. So I would take Grod Krovi as an easy 35 to 40 range. But I would say my median for the Black Ops 3 maps should be in that early 30s range. I will, I will, I, I'm not happy with Verrucked, but like I said, things happen. Shinonuma will be next time. Are you on PlayStation? No, I am on PC. Uh, though I am playing on Xbox controller and I can play on a P, on a uh, PS4 controller, I am on PC. That's I don't think PlayStation has modded maps, though they should. And you know, like, like as you see, I got tons of them, and we played a few of them. In fact. Uh, we did the Easter egg on Wanted. It's a cowboy style map. It's actually really fun. It frustrated the hell out of us, but we did complete the Easter egg. So there is a playlist of all the, of every single time we've put, we've streamed zombies and, uh, that's in there. Play some zombies one more time today. Um, I don't know. It's already six. You know what? You know what? We'll have some fun. We'll have some fun. Uh, well, th that is the end of the challenge. All right, we'll do this. So next time we will pick up with Shinonuma and we'll go on from there. But for fun, what map do you want? We can even do uh, one of the modded maps. We'll just do like one run. I got, like, I, I got tons of them. I got tons of them. You want to do, we can do Call of the Dead. You want to Call of the Dead? That might be pretty fun. We did the tower map already, but we can always just do it again. I'll let you guys pick. If you see anything you like. Call of the Dead? Oh, that's what I was thinking. I do have fucking so many of these. A lot of them look really cool. I haven't played all of them. What that? What? Uh, uh, scream? Alright. We also did uh, the East, we'll call it Easter Egg. It's a viable ending. Uh, we completed Bowser Tower. Call of the Dead or One Window. Do you know what? Um, unless one of you, uh, unless Dawson, you're also okay with One Window, we will flip a coin. That seems fair, right? I do have so many. I have 104 maps. Um, here I don't, I don't have a coin on me, so we will do a virtual coin. Does that sound fair? You misspelled the title. I did. I'm gonna fix that later. Uh, yes, Dawson already calls head. Okay. Okay, we're flipping. Google says heads. All right, we'll do one window challenge before. Yeah, I know. Uh, so that what was yours? Yours was Call of the Dead. So we'll do Call of the Dead. We'll do one round of Call of the Dead, and then we'll call it a day. Yeah, uh, Dragon Cub is Ethan, by the way. So when you hear us talk about Ethan, when you have when we're playing with Ethan, that's that's him. But all right, yep, we're gonna do one round of Call of the Dead. Classic map. Love this map. Ethan loves this map too. We need to play this. We need to beat the Easter egg. At some point, maybe next weekend, once you have all your shit fixed, we will uh, we'll come in here and we'll, we'll, we'll and we might, we're gonna beat Call of the Dead Easter egg. Yes. That's what that's what the coin said. The coin, the almighty coin said call of the dead. So that's what we're doing. Sorry, we just have to let it load in. There we go. We're just going right in. Damn. I forgot solo doesn't get you doesn't put you into a into a uh, menu. You just go right in. You don't think your internet's gone out yet, but you know the moment you join a game, the internet's going to go out. And plus, I would like it to be a different stream anyway. I want that to be a totally different video. Totally different totally different stream, VOD, whatever you want to call it. So, I mean, not that we couldn't do it later, but we'll figure it out. We'll probably do it next weekend. That sounds like a good time. Unless Friday is still a mess. Then we might do it Friday. No, I, that would be your luck. It would be our luck. Every single time, we're like, oh, this is going to work absolute, perfectly fine. It always goes bad. No, I know you're always down for Call of the Dead, because you, you've mentioned it, like, a whole bunch, and I love it, too. Wonder what happened to 
Oh. Hey, oh, jeez. The game does not like this. Give it a minute. Come on. Smoothing out. Please. There we go. It's starting to... Getting frostbite was so not on my list of things to do today. I know, Buffy. This is Buffy the Vampire Slayer, if you didn't know. Kinda got a fishy kick to it. Oh yeah, no, this is a quote remaster for Black Ops 3. Cause I don't have I mean I can I can uh, uh uh um get Black Ops 1. In fact I do have Black Ops 1, just not on Steam. Uh because I do think that it's ridiculous to pay forty dollars or whatever it is on Steam for Black Ops 1. If Activision made if Activision made the old games like depending on how old they are, like ten dollars with the DLCs. If they made it ten dollars with all DLCs, I would I would buy out the entire Call of Duty series on, on Steam. I would. But because they're still like forty dollars or twenty dollars each, absolutely not. Alright, looks like we're we've actually like legitimately smoothened out. Isn't there a gun on the wall here? Oh, it's <gasps> the MP5K. At what? How much was that? A thousand. Okay, cool. Never mind. I thought the box was further back there. Ooh, no, still, still having a little bit of trouble here. Apologies. I think it's the ice. That's not even a joke. I've actually heard that this map uh, is very high detailed, especially with the ice for some reason. And then I've seen people who have like really nice machine also uh, lag, which I don't have the greatest machine, but I I'm slowly upgrading it. Oh, come on. Can't we negotiate? Wait, do you see that? Um, I, I really like that frosted overlook for the perk. You see that at the bottom left? Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Yeah, that's who this is. I would prefer Robert England. Just blame Activision. That's what you could say that for anything. Like when, when, when Minecraft didn't work, blame Activision. They have like literally nothing to do with it. Still their fault. Yes, Styrog. I love the Styrog. I love this. I love this gun. I'm sad. I have it and I'm, I'm for the uh, Fallout New Vegas playthrough. I have the Styrog. Hey, it's the classic death machine. Cool. Come on, zombies. I'll take you on with my bare hands. Uh, I have the Steyr Og in a mod for that game, but it does like eight damage. It's so bad. I'm so depressed because I want to use it, but there's no point. <laughs> you're you're having a me moment. You know how like when I try to type fast in chat, it just doesn't work, and I get angry at everything. Why did my Hey, wake up. I don't think I'm gonna wake up. Oh, I literally need one more point. Oh, uh, one more set of point. There we go. Got it. They don't wake up until you turn the power on. I didn't know that. That's, I guess that makes a lot of sense now that I think about it. I, I, to be fair, I haven't played this map consistently since Black Ops 1. Cyrog's just so good. I love me a good bull pup. I know a lot of people don't. That, that's when the magazine uh, is behind the trigger. That's called a bull pup. Bull pup. I keep saying it weird. My mouth is dry. Look at that. I killed both of them. I was I didn't even see the other guy. George A. Romero, that's true. Was he alive for this? Like when it came out. Like I know he did the voice, but how, how much longer since this map came out did he pass away? Because I don't think it was very long. 
What's this one? This is Call of the Dead, but this is a Black Ops 3 kind of remake. Uh, when will you be playing the Fallout in Vegas stream? That is, is Thursday. Happening? My schedule is supposed to be No Man's Sky today. Tuesday is Batman. I've been playing through the Arkham series. Wednesday has been recently Star Wars Battlefront 2, the original. Um, and... On top of, and then Thursday is uh, New Vegas. After that, Friday, what were we doing Fridays? Was It was Minecraft. It's supposed to be Minecraft. But we haven't been doing Minecraft recently. Oh, we didn't smash the ground. Okay, Take it Ow. Get the hell out of my way. I'm coming through. Well, I think what makes you the bad guy, Georgie, is the fact that you're trying to kill me. I think that I think that's what makes you the bad guy. No, it's not. It's really not. Okay, we got money. We gotta go. He died a little after BO One came out. I think that's right. What was what was Black Ops One? Two thousand eleven. In BO2 zombies, you do the same. You don't do the same as BO3 attacks. What? Don't worry. We have the M72 law. And Mashishka dolls. We're. Ow! China Lake. I'm scared of things that go boom. Things that go boom will kill me. RPK. I'm not even licensed for this. No, you're not. <laughs> Get the hell out of my way. Why is the aiming so weird on this map? Stop touching me. Yeah, we do. Uh, George A. Romero died in 2011. So was B01 in 2011 as well? Because I think it was. It was either 2010, 2011. I'm like 90% sure. Because in BO3, riding zombies can hit you and kill you if you're not fast, if you're not careful. Yeah, I've encountered that. There we go. Hey, she has a tattoo. FR, it looks like. I wonder what that stands for. I don't know what her name is, so it might be her name. It's definitely not Buffy the Vampire Slayer. But the RPK is so good, you know? Like, this version seems even more overpowered than normal. The round thing looks weird. It's in a different font than normal. That's why. I also did see your comment about Black Ops 2, the Black Ops 2 zombie style. Uh, so I think I'm all caught up in chat. Let's just go ahead and do it. I remember... The scavenger being really good, but the VR-11 being very bad. So we do have Pack-a-Punch in this map, so we're good there. Get out of here. It was in the middle of 2011, I think, when this map was made. Okay, I think so I was right the first time. I would say BO2 Zombies are probably better. I don't know for how long you, uh, I've been playing BO3 Zombies. Yeah, I, we, we had Black Ops 2. Uh, all the boys. We. Hi. I really didn't dress for the cold. You think this is the hardest map to high round? I'm not trying to high round this. Uh, as I said, the challenge is officially over. This is just for fun. Who's keeping score? Um, that's a good question. Who on this map is keeping score? Because this is before Reznov takes... Uh, not Re Reznov. Reznov isn't in zombies. This is before Richthofen. You know, the German. Uh, not the Russian. Uh, that's when he takes over is after Black Ops 1. So I guess... Samantha for some reason? Ooh, I actually really want that. I actually really, really want that. I can use that on George. Split the defense. Get the hell away from me. 
By the way, you die. Is there, is there a perk behind him? Uh, it's it's not a good win. Come on. Yeah, this map is a BO1 map. Uh, originally. Get away from me. I don't know if headshots critical him. I think they might. Come on. Who's George? It's George A. Romero, who is a very, very big time. Like, if you ever seen a horror movie, hell, if you ever seen zombie movies, George A. Romero is the guy who made those happen. Like, he made all of the original classic uh, zombie movies. Without George A. Romero, zombies doesn't exist. Let's just say that. Zombies as they are today don't happen. Yeah, that big guy is chasing me. <laughs> He's chasing you down. Always. George A. Romero is always coming. I'm right here. You know where I am. You can see me. I know. It's not on my list of things to do today either. We. Are the machine? Are the um? This water is freezing. I forget what they're called. The big, the black hole uh, portal things that you can throw. What are they called? You get them in ascension. I know that. Are they on this map? See my answer? Yeah, Bo2 was the the golden age. Um, I would say that era. Yeah, because you had a lot of people into it. It was still rising up, if you will. I'm actually going to get this because I'm running out of ammo. Maybe now we can see a way out. Sorry, I'll look at chat in a second. Well, I mean, it's a good time. It's possible to get to round 100 if you're patient enough on Black Ops 1. There's a bug. I don't really want to use bugs. I think I know what you're talking about, though. Get out of here. Oh, great. Get out of here. I probably should have just switched to this. That's sad. Oh, and another one is... What? What is another one? Or Origins is trash because it's being chased in the mud. Uh, it's a little bit better. Well, uh, you, it really, stamina up is a necessity on the Origins. You almost have to run it. I thought we were going to get this Tyrog back. I was so happy. And with no infinite damage wonder weapons. Um... Well, the, the the Wonder Waffle is the the Wonder Waffle, to be technically more correct, is a infinite damage weapon. But you can only get that after you kill George, so it ties your hands. Blue eyes uh, is the German yell. Uh, yeah, I do. I know that. Her father, Red Eyes. Red Eyes is Shadow Man. Okay, so I guess this is. Well, all I was saying earlier is Samantha isn't, I don't think, spoken. She doesn't have any spoken parts on this map, but she is the one still in control. Yeah, we're just going to open up the map a bit. I actually forget how Pack-A-Punch works on this map. Is it just... Um, once you turn the power on? I want that. Like, I know... I think that tells you where. Hey. It's very rude of you. Get out of here. RBK is nasty. RBK is disgusting. <laughs> Worst map is Origins because of the mud. I I don't think it's the worst map. I do think the mud hurts it a lot. But I wouldn't say it's the worst. 
Die rise because of you can fall to your death. Because of all the jumping. You, uh, uh, earlier you mentioned that you keep mistaking die rise with the rise interact. If that's true here, or I think, I think it was you. Uh, maybe you're still thinking that. I'm not sure, but yeah, die rise. You have so much, so many chances to just fall off the map and die. It's annoying. I'm. A, I want to keep that zombie. So. Yeah, verticality. No, I. I think verticality would be very good on a zombies map. And I like the idea. I just don't think that they did it as good as you possibly can. I just don't think that one was it. I really didn't oh, hey, pack a punch. I'm not gonna get it, um, but it's I nice that it's here. So not on my list of to do today. I know, I know, you mentioned. First, Did I miss anybody? <laughs> no, I don't think I missed anybody. Okay, that's good. Go away. I don't, I don't, I don't need you. Wait. Actually, don't want you to die. Not yet. Did I open this? No. Open says me. The only thing zombies are smart for is avoiding falling to their death. That is true. They don't do. They don't do that. They do everything else pretty, uh, pretty well, or pretty badly. Actually. All right. We're doing okay. We're doing okay. I would have liked if I didn't go down once. No, you did not. She's wearing short sleeves. Actually, she's wearing a tank. Uh, she's wearing like a, uh, a pretty much a tank top and just jeans. And if you get jeans wet, you're having a bad day. How she's not frozen to death already is beyond me. Well, also because that's not how the game works, but shut up. Is he back there? Georgie. Where are you, Georgie? No, he's not. This water is freezing. I know. You should wake up the boys? You're right, I should. I'm not gonna do the Easter egg, but I can at least go wake him up. Gotta go. First time you see the Shadow Man is in Mob of the Dead. Really? Uh, I, need ammo. I did not know that. The way that this version of the crew dies is freezing to death in the closet. <laughs> hey, 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 that's... Uh, uh, that's not my fault, you know? They shouldn't have been there in the first place. Fuck, I'll take that. Well, that's just overkill. A stiletto to the skull? That that sounds awful. Why would you even say that? That hurts my. That hurts me. <gasps> You're here. Try to stay in the ship for warmth. Well, what if that's how that how this map worked? You slowly freeze over time, regardless, unless you're in a warm area, like inside the ship. Ammo, I'm a dead oh, God, Where'd the box go? Oh, it seems like it's back there. You want to play Varuk just not by yourself? If you have PC, I mean, uh, we'd be more than willing to play with you. I think I, I there's this one guy who. Fog's getting worse again. Widow's wine. <laughs> That's pretty good. That's a good Easter egg. No, uh, there's this one guy who plays zombies and he does it with, like, with his subscribers sometimes. And I'd like to do something like that. I think that would be pretty cool. That's back outside. I actually don't want to open that. Sorry, on PlayStation only. I mean, the best gaming system... The best gaming system is the one that you have. So, that's perfectly fine. But, I don't know. I, I sadly uh, do not possess a PlayStation. 
That's only the remake. I'm pretty sure. I'm like 90% sure that's that's for this map. I severely doubt Widow's Wine was in the original. Apparently the Shadow Man was in Mob of the Dead. I didn't know that shit. Oh. Any chance we can just be friends? No! Okay, we're good. Gotta get out of here. I like how you can hear the boss zombie. Yeah. You can just hear George from pretty much anywhere. It kind of, it, it kind of tells you how close and how far away he is. Nope. Good shit. You're a zombie? Maybe he's right. Maybe I'm a zombie the whole time. Hey, the VR-11. Hey, become a real man. Become a real boy. Oh, what? Oh. You know what? We're just going to take the G-11 and go. Uh, actually, we don't want to go this way. Georgie, why are you getting angry? We. I'll be taking that. I actually paid money to do the Derizon Drag Easter egg? Uh, we already did it on the channel. If you have PC, we could easily do it with you. Ethan is the master. Ethan, Ethan has memorized the entirety of the Ryzen Drag. In fact, he I think he has the steps tattooed on his arm. That's a joke. I don't think he, he, he didn't really do that. <laughs> I wouldn't put it past him. Could you guys stop spawning so fast? You like slow it down like 3%. That'd be great. Hi. How you doing, George? Someone's cooking food. It smells good, but we're here. We play zombies. Y'all feel me? <laughs> sure. Uh, my favorite. I only run Deadshot, though, of course. I wish I'm on PS5. Oh, you're on PS5. Uh, Ethan has a PS5. I don't know if he has Black Ops 3 and all the mo and all the DLC for it, but he's on PS5. That's right. Oh, shit. I don't know. What, what weapon did Buffy the Vampire Slayer use? I didn't watch that show. Uh, that wasn't really my thing. I'm the zombie granddaddy? Well, technically true. I don't like that you just said that to me, George. No. Oh. Only you refer to yourself as granddaddy. A little weird. It's where you started playing. Yeah, I know the PlayStation. Can't you use a, uh, a keyboard and mouse on PS5? Didn't they allow that? I think that's a thing. Have at ye. Oh, hi. How you doing? Hey, PhD flopper. That's actually pretty cool. We don't want it, but it's cool that's there. I was trying to wake up the boys, but uh, George was there. We'll we'll we'll, we'll do it. Uh, given I don't die. The presso. Wait, where's George? I'm at least good. Okay, never mind. Hey, Lemon, you play Fortnite? No. Uh, not really. I played it when it originally came out, but not after that. I'm not technically disinterested in playing it, but I doubt any of my friends are. Now, I'd, I'd only play squads. I would not. I wouldn't play solo. I was never great at that style of game. I think I only had like 
three or so, like three wins solo, and I had a few wins by on myself. I will say I played. Uh, what the other one? What was the other one that was like it that came at the time? Oh, what was it? No, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh, what what was it? PUBG. I played PUBG one time. I won, and then I I I, I got first. I won the whole game, and then I never played it again. <laughs> that was it. That was my whole PUBG experience. It actually happened the first time in Fortnite, too. I have just really good luck the first time I play games, I guess. Because the first time I played Fortnite, I won. Uh, and it took a while for me to win again. While we're here... No. I'm here, but I'm not willing to help. Going down is bad, too, because he keeps losing points. That is true. That is true. I'm not too worried about it, though. It's super annoying. Yeah, what's more annoying is when you're playing multiplayer and you lose uh, you lose money for people, your friends dying. Because uh, I remember we were, I, think, I forgot what we were playing. I think it was actually you, Ethan, who kept purposely dying, so we kept losing points. Come on, give me something. This looks a bit special. Okay. What's back here? There's gotta be something. I know Easter egg stuff. Stamina up. And the striker? Stake out. Different gun. Different era. Oh. The tape recorder. Oh! Uh, this is... For Nightmare Robert England stuff. That's pretty cool. Oh shit, 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 oh shit. Pack a bunch. Hi. You guys gotta get the hell away from me. And I gotta get No, that's gonna kill me, isn't it? Uh Robert England, we're in your stuff. I don't mind. That stopped that guy from coming in. <laughs> That doesn't really help. This water is freezing. Oh, got out. We're good. See my answer? Okay, I'll do that in a second. Where, 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 where oh, yours is there. Okay, if you go down, you don't lose points. Didn't know in the second map of World at War is where you get to see Dempsey. No, uh, Dempsey with the three soldiers. I don't think Dempsey's technically in that. I think, like, lore he is, but it wasn't the same voice actor. I don't think it was technically the character. Losing money is gay. Oh, then that's why Kevin loses money all the time. I figured it out. You're so lucky. Uh, bro, this is a freeze map. It is. Imagine what it was like in IRL. Uh, what's funny is... I think this is based off a real place. Not based off a real movie, but... It was based off a real a real event. Not that there were zombies and people were killing them. <laughs> Not that kind of real event. I mean, there was like a ship crash and people were trying to like document it. There's like a documentary team. I'd be more worried about the 115 if I was IRL. Oh yeah, no, no, no one would survive the zombie apocalypse. Oh, it's gone. I mean, I've kind of, I've, I've earned that. Where is double tap? I just thought about that. Is double tap even on this map? It has to be. Surely. It's one of, the, it's a Black Ops 1 map. Oof, 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 that's not good. Ammo low. Ammo low, bad. Um. Bye. I feel like a bird. 
<laughs> I, feel, I feel like a bird. <laughs> I like it. I like it. I, I'm digging it, Buffy. I don't. I don't normally care for you as a as a char playable character. Uh, fuck it. Gotta go. Better not to worry about freezing and zombies. Yeah. Front of the boat is double tap. What over here? Oh, this is mule kick. Oh, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. Yes. It was. Here, give me a second. I'm gonna, I'll, I'll read it. I'll read it in a second. It was the same voice without his really good lines. Oh, really? I never actually knew that. Well, then that that's pretty cool. Cause I knew like I knew it was. Uh, like like an Easter egg kind of thing that technically that was he was one of them, but I, I didn't know his voice actor did him in in that one too. Ooh, George is down bad. <gasps> I if I can pack a punch the RPK. No, that's bad. Fuck. I just, I just knew. Wait, we can kill, we can probably kill George though. Let's not freeze to death. Come on, 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 come on. No, 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 no. Ah, oh, fuck, man. I couldn't sneak past him. Because he did also one of the main characters in the Japanese... Yes, yes, I know that. They use a lot of their models. In fact, all of them are in it. Uh, one of the main Russian soldiers that you see is Nikolai. Uh, one of the main uh, German... Off uh, not German. Uh, Japanese officers is Takio. Uh, the, the character model. That's not. They're not the same people. And... Yeah, I had to get out of the water. I couldn't stay on the island. So I had to just risk it, and it was bad. Having only the scavenger was stupid. I shouldn't have even grabbed it. Uh, I wanted it to kill George. Uh, and who did I miss? Dempsey. Yeah, you already said that. Yeah, Dempsey's in the in the main World at War. Uh, he's one of the main guys. And you can either kill him or save him if you choose him a Roebuck. Uh, Ro Roebuck? Ro Roebuck, I think. And the thing is, you always let Roebuck die. That's the real answer. But, all right. Uh, that was fun. We, we definitely need to play... Uh, Call of the Dead again with Ethan and try to beat the Easter egg. I could have done better there, but I was just kind of fucking around. I wasn't taking it too seriously. Uh, I think we're going to end it here. I want to thank you all for, for joining me. Uh, did you know they also, they also had the same voice actors? I don't think maybe I can understand Takio. Uh, unless they changed their voice. Like maybe, maybe had the same voice actors, but had different voices. I can understand that because I'm pretty sure the guy, uh, the the uh, Nikolai character in the campaign sounded very different. Could be the same voice actor, just he tried to redo the voice. I see what you mean by the pop-ups now. Yeah, I'm only going to do them again. I wouldn't normally do this, but just for Ethan. Yeah, I press a button. There are two different buttons and they pop up. I had one before, but it didn't look nearly as good. Those actually look really nice and I love them. Uh, So... Yeah. Only the American. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would. Okay. Yeah, I, I believe that. That's good trivia. There we go. We we'll, we'll, might put that in a community post or something. We'll figure it out. Maybe a Discord thing. But yeah, we do have, as you saw, a Discord link in the description. Thank you guys for watching. I, would, I do want to thank. I want to roll through here real fast. Thanks to Dawson, Ethan for joining us, Jay. Uh, want to try to get everyone. Julian. Julian was here. Uh, it was a while of just you guys. Give me a minute. I'm going to get, I, I want to get through everybody. I like to thank everyone who's active in chat. Cause I, lo I love me an active chat. That was Julian. Primal was definitely here. So thanks to Primal. I think there was one other person. Uh, maybe not, but thanks to all of you for joining me. Uh, I'm, uh, glad you got to be along. I'm sorry that there was no No Man's Sky, but hopefully you enjoyed this enough. Uh, I'm going to continue the High Round series at some point, probably over the weekends, on like Saturdays. But don't quote me on that. We'll figure it out. Tomorrow should be Batman Arkham City. 
Uh, so hopefully you, if you enjoyed that kind of style, you'll come join us. And uh, till till next time, goodbye. Also, uh, uh, by the way, while Mondays and Fridays are supposed to be three thirty four, ev on on well, on Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays, that's always at five uh, Central Time. So like Fallout, uh, Fallout New Vegas, uh, Battlefront Two, and Batman are all at five Central Time. So there you go. If you want to catch that, I try to schedule my stuff like thirty minutes or so in advance. Today I couldn't do that, so. You can kind of check it that way if you need to, but yes. Anyway, thank you for watching and goodbye.